All right, folks, what we got right here, we got our wet boil probe and our dry boil probe. Our dry boil probe measures the air temperature inside this kiln. And you have a set point for it for hardwoods and softwoods. Our wet bulb, you have a set point for it. Now as the temperature increases, humidity out of the wood gets in the air, that sets off your wet bulb. And your wet bulb, you can adjust it up and down to uh, according to what kind of wood you want to use. Now we just put regular water in here. You want good clean water. This is like a little sock, what they call it, like a little wick. It wicks that moisture up. And what you want to do, you just want to put that on there, on that probe, make sure it's on there good. And when you're running this kiln, this is what you got to go, come down here and check. You got to come down here and check this water will evaporate and this sock will dry out on you. And you do, do not want that sock to dry out on you because then you get a then you get a false reading on the humidity level in your kiln. So this is very important that you keep it moist. Have to check this. I like to check it every two days once the kiln gets up and going. That way I ain't opening the doors and shutting it. I come down here every day when the kiln's running and check my temperatures, check my set points, check my moistures, see what it's reading. But to open the chamber up, I found about every two days to check this guy. So it's gonna show you what we got right here. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. And uh, found this sitting out in the woods uh, the other day. This is an old jug. Y'all could imagine what might have come in it. Uh, but yeah, it's one of them things that family had to do to survive back in the depression era. Every now and again, when I'm walking through the woods, I'll find one of these sitting out. He used to dig holes, cover the, the jugs up with a metal sign or a piece of tin. Uh, that way, when he walked through the woods, he'd take a stick, and when he hit that tin, he knew he found a shine. <laughs> Our dry bulb right here measures, uh, that thing's loose and they tighten it up. Hold on, can you start over? 